Hi, welcome to a quick video walk around for our BMW 1 Series Cabriolet. Um, bit of an older one, I know, 09 plate, lovely, lovely history, like there was a carrier bag full of it, came with it, so on the pictures it's just going to be sort of a sampling of what's there. Um, but I'll show you around the actual vehicle itself now. Really, really clean and tidy, um, would probably benefit from a, you know, a really intensive valet, I would say, just because of the light interior. Um, we've done what we can, but it's, it's definitely could be improved further still. But I'll show you around anyway, so Sedona Red Metallic, which is like a light orangey type metallic. Uh, halogen headlights as you can see there. It's the M Sport one so it has the more pronounced bumpers and side skirts and whatnot. Uh, 18 inch M Sport alloy wheels. Just a couple of, I'm going to touch these in but I just want you to know that there are a couple of very small scratches down there on the side skirt. I'm just waiting for the correct paint to arrive to do those. I didn't want to splash any old red on there because it's quite unique this one. A couple of curb marks on the alloys here and there. doesn't really detract from the overall rear parking sensors just down there it's just got the little valance that you get with the M Sport ones as well all the original sales brochures owners manuals all that sort of stuff there you've got the optional wind deflector as well it's, that was quite an expensive extra when it was new can't imagine particularly easy to find now either a uh, little toolkit there and toothbrush for cleaning the wheel should you be of the mind little thing for demisting the uh, windscreen as well but yeah that's the obviously you can see the roof's down roof down and roof up same amount of boot space because it t stows itself away in this area so reasonable boots obviously you remove all that as well wouldn't you i've just got it there for demonstration purposes emergency triangle there as well a little bit of rubber missing from the aerial there i'll just point that out work and overall condition for an 09 plate car is fantastic. The hood is black cloth. I'll show you, I'll put it up at the end of the video so you can see the roof working and obviously see the condition of it. Back seats there, mats all present, it's got isofix points your two outer rear seats you've got armrests and speakers and stuff here as well obviously the leg room isn't huge because it's a one series cabriolet so not going to be massive is it but for kids or whatever would be fine in the back adults may be a bit of a stretch but yeah that's your decision to make front seats again in great condition considering it's the i think they call it oyster the light leather it's um really nice and clean and tidy throughout but like I say just some of the carpets and stuff maybe would benefit from a scrub uh, right sports seats in the front with these extended seat bases airbags built in down the side you've got height adjustment on the passengers and drivers like I see there that mat could do with a you know blast with a pressure washer just the weather at the moment doesn't really allow me to get them soaking wet inside uh, it's got this wood veneer there is a name for it I think it's poplar but I will double check the spec sheet and put it all on there for you. Airbag cut off for the passengers if you want to use this one for kiddie seats. And it does have the isofix points in there as well. So you can securely fit that in there, should you wish. Wood carries on through the dash, of course. Pretty unremarkable in there. Put your M Sport kick plates. back over to the driver's side now so electric mirrors electric windows that one does all the windows at once comes in with part of the roof mechanism but you can just control all the windows yourself manually if you wish uh, Sedona red metallic they are on the build sticker You've got your lighting controls there again driver's mat could do with a scrub wipers there indicators and onboard computer there nice chunky m sport leather steering wheel air recirculation and your audio controls over here 
uh, has the voice button but doesn't have the voice module. All the steering wheels are built the same. So as far as I'm aware, nothing's coming up regarding telephones or voice modules when I press these two buttons. Lovely miles for the year, 88,362. Even a decent bit of fuel in there, quarter of a tank, get you going. Little storage area up here. Traction control hazards and door locking here. Two keys, both original BMW. They look like the rechargeable ones. Engine stop start button. BMW business CD. Uh, AM and FM. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, no DAB. And single slot CD and auxiliary. I'll show you the aux point in a second. Dual zone climate control. Heated seats for your front passengers. Three stage ones. That's your engine stop start as in automatic stop start, not the ignition one like up here. That's where we action the roof, which I'll do in a minute. Ashtray, six speed manual gearbox, got the M Sport knob on there of course. The storage areas here, and if we lift that up, there's your 12 volt and your auxiliary endpoint. Traditional handbrake, not a leather one. Not, not a leather one, not an electronic one, it is leather. Illuminated vanity mirrors, interior lighting, looks like an auto dimming rear view mirror from the sensor. I'm no expert in that field, but that would be my guess. Uh, right, let's put the roof up so you can see all that working. Just hold down that button there. That's as far as I can twist round, so hopefully this gives you an idea. I'll show all that work in there as well. So as you can see, no levers or catches to do. And then if you keep it held down, all the windows automatically come up by themselves as well. Right, let's hop out and have a look at that with the roof up. So there we are, black cloth roof. Again, this could do with a little pressure wash in my opinion, just a couple of little areas of sort of greenness throughout. But in terms of the condition, absolutely solid glass back roofs with heated screens the original BMW one still with the logo so that's not been replaced but yeah no nicks or tears or anything just in need of a pressure wash I would say which we will probably do to be honest um, it's the interiors that I can't get wet but the exterior should be fine so we shall get that done and there you are um, if I've missed anything you've got any questions please just give us a call I'll pop out and check for you straight away I'll include, along with this video, as many images as I can take of the inside, the outside and the raft of paperwork that's with it. So I will hit the 100 images, I'm sure, with this one, which is the limit on Auto Trader. But if you require anything else that's not shown, please just let us know. Um, more and more people seem to be buying cars now and just having them delivered without coming down to us. Um, hopefully, the information we've offered here gives you the confidence to do so. Obviously, if you're more local to us and you want to pop in and see the car for yourself, you're more than welcome. Um, we just ask that you please make an appointment first. Okay, that's that concluded then. Thank you very much for watching.